Welcome to studentevaluator.com. Purpose of this video is to show you just how easy it is to make your own report card comments. Once you subscribe, you'll get a username and password and you can sign in. Once you sign in, you're going to notice a brand new toolbar across the top. With this toolbar, you can create new reports and look at existing saved reports. You can look at your existing subscription plan. We have amazing additional resources for teachers to use to make creating your report card comments even faster and easier. A video tutorial, which is the same as the one you're seeing right now. News, which is our latest news section, which will have blog comments and just interesting testimonials from other users and contact us where you can get a hold of us if you need anything whatsoever. So I want to create a brand new report card comment. So I click on my reports, click on new student report, click on create a new student, or if I'm creating another report card comment, if it's for term one or term two, I would just select the student from my list. But I want to create a new student record. For the full name, this is just to help you identify who the student is. So I'm going to put in their last initial. For the common name, I'm just going to use the name that you want to see on that report card comment. I'm going to select the gender. Now all I do is answer the questions that go along with each of the learning skills. So I'm just going to do this randomly. As you get faster at this program and you start to recognize the questions, you'll go through these questions even easier. As I'm clicking on these radio buttons, the database on our website is actually compiling a report card comment. One of the new options with Student Evaluator is the character education comments. So in this section, you can choose up to three character education comments to either pick a strength for or a need for. So I'm just going to choose respect, empathy is a need, and perseverance is a strength. Moving on to personal comments. This is the opening comment that will begin your report card comment. John has had a fantastic term. This is the closing comment, which is a dialogue box to enter a short comment that is more personal in nature and includes an encouraging comment to conclude the entire learning skills section. John is to spend more time on his homework tasks. Good luck in grade five. Now that I have everything filled out, I can simply hit generate report. And what's amazing about our program is it will tell you exactly what their learning skills mark should be based on the resp responses in your questionnaire. And it generates your entire bottom comment for you. All in proper spelling, grammar, punctuation, and by generating that report, it gave me 1,721 characters, which is going to fill out most of your report card box. If I'm not totally happy with this comment, I can simply click Regenerate Report, and it will create a brand new combination of phrases. What's nice about it as well is I can look at previous report cards that will show up underneath and compare and contrast. So the only thing I need to do now if I'm content with this report card comment is I click on copy to clipboard. I can take a quick look at it, hit OK. And now it will copy it to my clipboard and I can save the report. Now it's saved, I can open up my report card program and simply paste it directly in. And that's how easy it is to make your own report card comments using Student Evaluator. Again, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please contact us. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'm sure you'll find after the first time you use Student Evaluator that you won't know what you did without it. Take care. Have a great day.